Inspired by tragedy, just hours ago, local student documentary filmmakers premiered their film inspired by the murder of a classmate. 10 News reporter Rachel Bianco is joining us now live from High Tech High School, and it must be a powerful documentary, Rachel. Kimberly, that theater was packed tonight. It has been almost four years to the day since students here lost a classmate and his brother in an unspeakable tragedy. And tonight's documentary is just one way of how they're turning their pain into purpose. Honestly, I only want to give the world one thing. To change it. To change it into what we all want it to be. So we can stop fighting. This is Sean Fuchs in 2011. Months later, Sean and his brother Kyle were shot to death by their father. He then killed himself and set fire to their home. I think when Sean and Kyle passed away, it was a huge toll on Heights of Kaichula Vista. The loss of these boys got their classmates talking about violence in general. It's not about gun control, gun rights, any of those things. There's so many ways, and it's not just one solution. Solutions are featured in their new documentary, Beyond the Crossfire. Kyle and Sean's mom was in the theater to see the credits flash in honor of her sons. For my sons to have been a part of the inspiration for something that I think is going to be so meaningful to many people, um, it's, it's an honor. By the sound of the applause, these students are just as honored to be a part of it. 45 students worked on that project. They raised $32,000 through Kickstarter. Reporting live in Chula Vista, Rachel Bianco, 10 News.